Hi, my name is Abhishek Saxena and I'm working as a transformation leader with one of the US healthcare analytic firm based out of Nevada. On the scale of 10, I would rate uh, 10 out of 10 to the MIT course because this is competitive course uh, and the, from the support perspective, you got all the necessary support. The material was really helpful, the course was really planned, uh, the staff and faculty was really helpful and very knowledgeable and you also have a career assistance program in MIT which can help really uh, to get a new opportunity in the industry. I think it has been a great pleasure and I'll cover each of them one by one. First of all, my great thanks to the buddies who has actually been helping me in uh, the course throughout day one. Uh, there were situations when I ran to a technical challenges while installing some of the libraries, uh, the software related to machine learning and AI and I reached out to them just sending the snapshots and they connected with me over the phone call helping me uh, how to resolve that issue. From the faculty, the faculty is really knowledgeable. Uh, Throughout the course, there are videos that you can go through and apart from the course, you also get some emails and some uh, research work links on the Slack groups and, the, uh, and uh, from different portals, you can go through those. There are Q&A sessions which are organized by the, uh, by the people and there are webinars as well. And the interesting part is that for the webinars, the feedback is taken from the students about the availability. Generally, that happens over the weekend at the time when most of the people are available. Uh, there's a proper feedback mechanism that goes through. After each module, there's a feedback form that you need to fill in where they ask for uh, whether you found it interesting. Is it something which is actually meeting the expectation that you're looking for? from the course? Uh, did you found the assessment, uh, uh, you can say, tough or easy so that they can make the changes appropriately? Uh, also from the career assistance program perspective, you will be reached out by the team who can actually help you in finding new opportunity, drafting your resume. So I think uh, from the day one, uh, it has been a great journey and I would really like to thank all of the staff members who have been involved in designing and delivering this program. Yes, uh, what I would say is that you don't need to be afraid of new things. Generally, people think that there is a new technology which is emerging. You might not be able to learn those things because it might be too technical. But you know, with new technologies, there are new softwares coming in the market. For example, so to say in machine learning and artificial intelligence. If you talk with anyone, it will first think that it's going to be very complicated programming, but it's not the case. You have the things available, the tools available if you are I uh, mean, you just have the dedication and you know the basics about the, uh, about the technology, you will be able to understand it, you will be able to uh, do good progress and you will be able to learn and add a lot of value to the resume.